Another day, another dollar. <laughs> I'm up here with two Pilates. I just got back from Cute little, cute Jimmy. Little hey Jimmy. I look tired. Jimmy. But <laughs> Sean walks in and he goes, come here. Uh, I'm like, what? What's wrong? <laughs> well, I guess my Zara package got delivered. I am like two things per box. I know, because it's coats and stuff. I'm filming a haul for you guys, so that's why there's so many boxes, but oh my God, like that's so overwhelming. My little cup, I love it. My little handmade cup. And I think I'm only gonna do two shots this morning. Because I had coffee at 7 p.m. last night um, at this church thing that we went to, and that was not a good idea. So I went shopping after Pilates today and ended up spending hours in home goods. Anywho, I got some presents for my dad and then I got some things for the house. As you can see, I bought some things that I probably don't need. I mean, I do need them, but I was gonna like try to thrift or get some like antique pieces for a shelf or like a buffet organizer. This is getting out of control. This is all products that I need to try, that I need to organize, and I thought that I would put them on a shelf and get one from Home Goods for now. So I actually bought two because I couldn't decide on which one was more functional for me. Yeah, I was thinking about getting like an actual shelf that I can shut everything away and then I was going to put my makeup on a stand next to my vanity so that I can just reach for it when I go to do my makeup just because I have so much product that won't fit into these two drawers over here. So I'm gonna decide on how I wanna set it up and test these two out because I can always return. Oh, also my birthday present finally came in from Sean and look how cute this necklace is. This is a micro link design and I got it in the yellow gold. This is from Shop Gold, GLD. And yeah, so this is the 16 inch micro link yellow gold CZ necklace. So I thought it was really pretty and unique and I love the look of the links and I don't have anything this short. So I need to just go through all of this stuff over here and try to organize it as best I can. Oh, I bought this one because I really liked the wood and I also liked the basket style organizer and that's what I thought I was going to get anyways. And it was like 60 bucks, which isn't too bad, but it's good quality. And I like this color wood because it kind of complements the wood that's over here. And this one's a little bit more of a rustic, darker wood. So maybe I thought it would contrast. And I liked that this one is just little shelves and so it's flat. So you can just stick stuff in it and it's smaller. But I like how much more space this one has. The only thing is that these baskets, I'm not sure how stable it's gonna be. Like, like if I have a bunch of stuff in here, a lot of small things, I still need to have something that gives it structure. So I went ahead and got these organizers as well. And I was just gonna stick them in the side. Like it just keeps everything from falling over and getting super cluttered. Use this one for PR and then the other one for makeup and then I'll see if I still like how functional that is. And who knows, maybe eventually I'll move one of these into the bathroom so that I can have a little bit more storage in there. I'm gonna start from the bottom and work my way up. Christmas party. 
at our friend Courtney's house. I didn't wash my hair today because I am gonna wash it tomorrow because we're celebrating Christmas tomorrow. Tomorrow's Christmas Eve. So I'm putting this treatment in from Nioxin into my roots. I, I think you can technically use this like every day so it doesn't have to be on dirty hair. But I'm putting this on my hair right now because I'm gonna put it in a slick bun for the party. And I can't decide what to wear yet. I have this black like bodycon kind of dress and I was thinking about wearing black boots with it. What I can't decide on is if I wanna wear like this long cardigan or if I wanna throw a sweater on over this and have it be like an oversized sweater, tight skirt, boot kind of moment. All right, here is the dress. This is from Super Down Revolve. I think it's like under 50 bucks, this dress. I was thinking about wearing this cardigan situation. It's like a trench coat cardigan with a tie. I thought that would be really cute. And then obviously I'm gonna have my hair back in a bun. My Dolce Vita boots that I'm obsessed with. And these are kitten heels, so they're like super comfortable. Outfit number one. I think it's cute, you know? It's kind of giving Carole de Ville or like rich auntie. <laughs> or I can do an oversized sweater over top of the skirt with the boots. Okay, I have this cream sweater from Vici. and have it be kind of like a peak of a moment. This is way more comfy. Um, actually, I think this is the vibe. What's going on <laughs> with me right now? I'm in my luteal phase, I'm feeling bloated, okay? And I feel like this covers up everything, but it also kind of almost gives like an Ariana Grande vibe. And I love that. So, okay, now I need to do some jewelry. So I'm gonna do rings my heart ring signature and my signet ring cz ring the emerald cut nope this is the oval cut and one of them fell out in my purse so oh well of course my majuri rings my crest what's this even called the crescent ring or the not the croissant ring but i think it's a crescent ring what no, they have one that's called the croissant ring. This one's a croissant ring, <laughs> in case you're wondering what that means. But um, this isn't from a jury. This is from Amazon, and it's definitely tarnished. And this is also from a jury. This is my favorite ring that I own. And I like to stack them together because they're just, like, so pretty. So those are my rings. What? Well, I still have to do my hair new micro wink necklace from shop gold for the same theme i'm gonna pair my large link necklace that i got from paris like a random shop in paris and i think that's like a fun little stack so then for earrings obviously i need to do my hair first but i'm thinking that I go, since I went so heavy on the necklaces, I go something like simple with the ears, with these like studs. So let me see what that looks like, but I'm gonna do my hair really quick. I actually went with a slick back ponytail, just cause I couldn't be bothered to try to get the bun in order. And then, oh, for lips, I'm doing like a cherry cola kind of moment. Let me see if I can show you better lighting. Yeah like a cherry cola vibe. And I use the lip liner, Rare Beauty lip liner in Wise. It's like a brown color. And then the Summer Fridays Lip Butter Balm in Cherry. And that's my lip combo. Super pretty. I feel like it kind of gives Hailey Bieber vibes. And then this is the entire outfit. I think I'm just gonna wear like a black purse with it, but this is what it looks like. A scraggly little ponytail, but it's fine. For perfume, I'm doing Mugler Alien. Oh no, this is Mugler Angel Elixir. It's so good. Very yummy. And then I might combine it a little bit with Glossier U. 
just to give it more of like a lived in feel. Mm. Okay. celebrating Christmas today. It's Christmas Eve currently. And we're about to go to my parents' house. And we're gonna like make some food and open up, like family gifts there. Sean and I are actually gonna do our gifts like later this week because he's going to South Carolina tomorrow, like on actual Christmas, to see his family. So um and he's flying like standby so so I can't go. Anywho um I'm wearing my mom's handmade sweater. Super cute. I'm wearing a bow in my hair. I don't even know if it's straight, but we'll find out. And then also the matching leg warmers with a skirt because it's like 60 degrees out. And my platform Uggs. And then I'm also bringing an outfit for my sister. It's the red one that I wore for Paris Fashion Week of the same brand. And we're gonna take a picture. I'm very hungover right now. So this Christmas party last night was fun for sure, but I just drank way too much wine. So I'm a little bit shaky right now, but anyways, let me back up and give you guys full outfit reveal. Super cute. Anywho, um, yeah, this is the vibe for today. I've got my hoodies, got these. So anyway, we're packing stuff up, like all of our food and stuff. And then we're gonna head to my parents' house, which is like 30 minutes away. Oh, and I tried a new lip liner today and I really like it. It's not new, but it's just like, I haven't used it in a while. It's Max Spice. I think it's perfect for the holidays. So, anywho, that's what's happening right now. I thought I would check in with you guys because I kind of left hanging after the party last night. Somebody got a little too good. They did. Ooh, can I have one? Aww. The rest of it? Yeah. I'm so hungry. Mm. Alright, let's go. We are at my parents' house. And I'm gonna start making this croissant, ham and cheese croissant bake that I saw on TikTok. But it's like you chop up the croissants and put them in there in this egg wash. And I'll show you in a second, but I think I'm gonna make like the slider version of it. Here's your garlic powder as well. Watch a movie. Like, 
Yeah, Hi, Steen. How's it going? It's going great. What are you making? Mac and cheese? cheese. Hello. Hello. What are you doing? I'm making a croissant, ham and cheese croissant bake. I saw it on TikTok. Oh, on the TikTok. 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 Yeah. Honey, honey. I got some Kroger. I got some Peter. You know what that would be good with on this beer? He wasn't even like. He. When you go to check. Of course I can, honey bunny. Can you please start in the Keep Macy away from my noodles at all times. I guess. I guess when you know. Hi guys, I'm meeting up with Jules. If you are new here, Jules is my best friend. And I'm meeting up with her at this coffee shop. We're gonna be doing our vision boards. So I'm really excited to do that. I love doing this before the New Year's every year. And I've already kind of sat with myself and set kind of some of my goals. And I'm trying something new this year and I'll show it to you guys maybe when I get home today. But I've been doing the, I've been reading the 12 week year essentially you plan per quarter and make your goals for 12 weeks instead of the whole year and attack those in a way that you can like quantify and measure you can like measure your success so anywho that's um what i'm doing with my goal setting this year but i also wanted to do like overall yearly goal setting um kind of to set the tone for the year and i like to do this visually because it really helps me like visualize it and manifest it and speak it into existence and um, work hard for those things. And I always set it as my background. So go on Pinterest and I pick out a bunch of pictures that resonate with me and my goals for this year. I will put it into Canva and make a little collage and make one for my phone and also my computer background. And it really, I don't know. I love the way that it like makes me feel and it just sets the tone for the year but i think it's always fun to do it with a friend if you just want to do like the vision board part together and have someone to like bounce ideas off of and like bounce your goals and stuff because it's nice to talk to somebody especially if it's your best friend Good morning. It's an exciting day. My sister is getting married. Well, she got eloped last year, so they've been married for a year legally, but this is her wedding elopement party day. I just got to the brewery in Monroe where we're setting everything up and it's going to be like basically a wedding without walking down the aisle, like a reception party. Um, anywho, I just got here and it's like 10 a.m. and we have a uh, makeup artist and hair person coming to do everybody's makeup and hair not me i chose to opt out um and yeah i'm we're basically just setting up in the venue today this morning and then we're gonna go get ready and then we're gonna start taking pictures around four it's gonna be a fun hectic day and i'm really excited i'm gonna show you guys the venue in a second but it's gonna be an exciting day so let's go
Thank you.